What's up YouTube? I know a lot of you guys are waiting for this series to start and here it is my first episode and my first road to glory on NCAA football 12 got my quarterback Philip Brooks who's a balanced quarterback in um, Maplewood High School in Minnesota 6'1", 222 and I'll be planning on playing all four years with him and doing the series all the way through so I think it's time to get started and see what we got here in my player. But before we get started, I had to pick three teams I was interested in. I picked the Minnesota Gophers, the Miami Hurricanes, and the Wisconsin Badgers. And we'll see what other teams get interested in me throughout my high school senior season. Time to start week one. So let's get it. Second and ten for the Hurricanes. Brooks drops back, looking to attempt his first pass, but the running back drops it. Not good for a quarterback looking to get a big school scholarship. Third and ten later, finds his receiver coming over the middle across the field for a big first down. Third and five now, Brooks looking left, and look as he threads the needle to his receiver for his first touchdown in the season. Now the second quarter, Brooks doesn't like what he sees, so he takes it himself, showing off his running ability. That'll have a scout's attention for sure. And Maple was running back with score two touchdowns on their way to a 28-7 victory. Only 40 recruiting points, but it's just the first game of the season. And check this out. The Iowa State Cyclones are interested in Phillip Brooks. Hopefully more schools start becoming interested as well. Now in the second game, week two, Brooks looking for his running back, and he drops another one. Brooks had a tough day with drops and sacks. Brooks on third and 13, finds his man over the middle, breaks a tackle, picking up a big chunk of yards. On first down, Brooks finds a wide open receiver over the middle of the field who gets inside the five, and that would lead to a field goal. End of the first half now, Brooks on fourth down makes a nice pass to convert, and they would add another field goal before half. So second half now, Brooks trying to generate some offense, but he's sacked on the play. Brooks was really beat up today. So he throws a quick pass to his tight end to counter the blitz. Nice play there for a first down. Fourth quarter now, Brooks trying to make a comeback. Hitting his receiver on the post for a first down deep inside enemy territory. And that would set up a touchdown. Brooks trying to tie this game, but he's tackled in the backfield. They'll have to try again later with a minute left. Brooks finds his running back on the screen pass, who gets up past midfield, runs past the defenders until he's tackled inside the five. That will lead to a touchdown, and Maple will win the game. Brooks with 300-plus passing yards on the day, but no touchdowns, so only 73 points. Week 3 now against Rochester, Brooks play action on 3rd and 1, rolling to his right, but he throws it into traffic and he throws an interception. Later in the first quarter, no score still, Brooks doesn't like what he sees, so he takes it off, and there is nothing but green in front of him. Brooks showing off the wheels all the way to a 70-yard touchdown run. The scouts gotta love that. Now later in the first quarter, Brooks hitting his receiver over the middle, wide open for a first down, trying to extend this lead, then first and goal, Brooks takes a quarterback draw for a score, his second on the day. Now in the third quarter, Rochester has scored 24 unanswered points, but on first down, Brooks looking long for his receiver, who had two defenders on him for a huge play. Brooks on third and 13, rolls out to his right, fires to an open man who gets inside the five. It would lead to a touchdown run. Now Maplewood looking to capitalize on a turnover. Brooks going up the middle, and he's going to look to score for his third touchdown, but he stopped just short at the one-yard line. First and goal, Brooks play action, blindsided by a blitzing linebacker, puts it on the ground. It's picked up by a defensive lineman. Brooks not giving up on the play, though. He's going to run up past his teammates, try his best to catch him, and he finally gets him at the 10-yard line, but Rochester would score a touchdown, trying to make any comeback he can, Brooks just heaving it deep for a receiver who had his man beat, he's going to score a big touchdown, but Rochester would hold on to the ball in their next possession, and the Hurricanes would lose their first game, 106 recruiting points this game from Brooks, he had a good day through the air and an excellent day on the ground, but the team just could not come together and get this third win. So tune in for the next episode. Probably be weeks four through seven in the high school season. Please rate the video and give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about this series so far. And so we'll get a couple more episodes of the high school games in. And then it's on to signing day. That's going to be exciting.